Well, um, it's appropriate that we're here talking about germs because Kim has so many germs floating around our food at this point with her shoes. I mean, I mean didn't anyone ever tell you it's not polite to put your shoes on the counter? You know what? I couldn't sit at the counter, so they have me standing here. So I'm enjoying this. Well, I can't wait. We could put you in the corner. No, no, no. Uh, we're back. Your school is back in session, and when that happens, that means the kids go away to school yeah. and they yeah. come home with oh. a lot of new germs yeah. into the house. So Sophie Liano is here. She has some of her favorite foods that's going to help protect or boost our immune systems. Yeah. I need that because yeah. I've got we a lot do. of We all do. Especially with the change of season. Oh, yeah. I know, yeah. and it's the kids back at school. But, know. you know, what I'm going to show you today is how to make this immune boosting shot. And whenever I feel, you know you feel when you get that little tickle? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Or you feel a little bit under. Well, I drink this shot, and I'm telling you guys, it works. Okay. 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 You want to know. But can't we, what if... We just can we just take vitamins? Well, oh, you true. can you can take vitamins, but honestly, as a as a nutritionist, I prefer that people try to take uh, the the nutrients from foods because okay. a it's less expensive yeah. and b yeah. your body actually recognizes those compounds and use it uses it in the way nature intended. Whereas sense. supplements okay. are slightly different. So okay. we all going to do this at the same time? Is oh. that right? Well, Rob first off, shall I? Do you want to yeah. drink it first? Yeah. No. 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 Go ahead. Okay. I want to. Let me show. Do I want to know what's in it? Yeah. first? No. Go ahead. Go <laughs> yeah. ahead. I think you actually do want to know. Okay. So for you, for those of you at home, this is actually really easy to make, and and you can find all these ingredients in your local grocery store. Okay. Very inexpensive. Perfect. So the first thing that I'm putting in is two tablespoons or the juice of mm -hmm. two lemons. That's, That's good. Your, all right. What is that, Kim? That's yeah. your clears your yeah. vitamin C. Vitamin C. Right, guys. Oh, okay. <laughs> right. So, I'm trying, Kim. Kim. <laughs> Thank, <laughs> Thank you, so much. Hey, Kim. We didn't know was was in no Oh answer. my gosh. All right. The next thing that I'm putting in is the juice of a thumb of ginger root. That sounds like witch's brew. Yeah. All right, now. Ginger. New side of ginger root. It's ginger. Your fence. Now, <laughs> the thing, do any of you ha like ginger? Or I love ginger. Uh, I have ginger yeah. every day. You do? Yeah. Yeah. And, and that's why you rarely get sick. I rarely get sick. Every day I have lemon and ginger. How do you get the juice out of ginger? Well, you just juice it in a juice. So, oh, really? Or you can put it in the garlic press. But the thing about ginger, it actually contains a compound which is antiviral, particularly yes. if you have respiratory, respiratory viruses. In this country, it's called respiratory. respiratory. Oh, oh, my God. God. For those of you at home who don't speak the Queen <laughs> Kim, um, <laughs> it's respiratory. Down. All right. What? Respiratory. <laughs> Guys, are we ready to carry on? But come on. Come on, so continue. All right. You, Sophie. We then love you. The next so ingredient in the brew is turmeric. I know. That's for right. memory. Turmeric. Again, now, turmeric. What does that do? Say. That is for memory. Yes, yes, yes it yeah, does. It actually yes. is good for your brain, brain health, yes. but it's also very good for uh, immune function, so too. Turmeric, turmeric, turmeric. In England, okay. turmeric. Okay. In England. Okay. That's just like out of, the, out of the spice cabinet, right? Just, to get yeah. To the now, shop. actually, yeah. what you can do, you can actually use the spice can, the oh, okay. uh, oh. brown spice, or you can use fresh turmeric, which is even more powerful, which you can juice. Perfect. Okay. Next, a little bit of um, raw honey. Mm, that's, oh, that's good. That's, that's good. going to give it a well, little Well, you are sweetness. certainly going to need that for yes. the little bit of sweetness. <laughs> oh, All right. Sure. All right, my Wait, friends. Wait, what's that? Can we well, put some sugar in That is, you're going to have No sugar, no chocolate. That is optional. That's a little bit of oregano or oregano oil. Oh, Again, oregano. 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 Just that's a little, little. little. Oh, Sophie, that's yes. so good for you. Yeah, that's yeah. very good yeah. for you. And that's yeah. optional. But I, I just do want to say for those at home that if you choose to use that, you do need to check with your healthcare provider first. Oh, good. Always, okay. particularly if you're on meds. Was the volume too loud on the speakers and the ears out there that you don't got the oregano and... Mark, what is it? English. It's English. <laughs> is it? Okay. Okay, we're ready. All right, listen, All right, uh, Mark, are just are doing? Okay, now, I'm going to count you down. Everyone, are you shooting? doing a shot? Shot. Oh, boy. Three... Two, one. <coughs> it's pretty good. Oh, that's pretty good. Ooh, it's pretty I love good. it. Okay. I like it. I, I love it. I like it. Another I'll have some nice. more. Now, Wait, there's some, there's oh, stuff you want another one? I really like another one. Take another one. That was good. That was good. I don't have any more. Question for you guys. Would you make it at home? Definitely. I would. Could I make it I would, Sophie. Yes, you can. Okay, then yes, I would make it. Wait, if I... Sophie, like, you make a big amount. You can... That's a great idea, Rachel. You can make a big amount. It's not bad. All right, now, guys, I just want to move on. Yeah. I want to move like, on, and I just want to throw yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. What, I want to show you yeah. some foods that are also going to really help you okay. at home. Mushrooms, right? Yes. I think mushrooms. I call them medicinal because they have such um, significant yeah. benefits for your immune system, particularly really? shiitake that. mushrooms in particular, and also oyster mushrooms. Shiitake mushrooms contain okay. beta glucans, which are like the little soldiers, Kim, that yes. fight those germs. Oh, that's good. Everyone, okay. yeah. we we made <laughs> our own. Okay, mushrooms. Spicy. 
They made their own. Yeah. All right, so I would say... <laughs> no, that's a bad job. Debbie, are you... No, no, let me, no. Let me, do we, we have, have one of those bags that... Bags that uh, yeah, where, where, where those bags one go? Of those bags. Are you all right? Can I, can I continue, Debbie? Continue, it's just burning. And Ken will get you some water. All right, the next thing, um, and I want you to try and get mushrooms two okay. or three times a week. All right. The uh, next like thing. how much? Did like what that serving well, size? Well, just a serving size, okay. and you can cook them, throw them Cooked in soup, stir fries. Cooked is absolutely fine, but okay. shiitake very important. Next one is your cruciferous veggies. These have significant compounds that really, really boost your immune system, and uh, broccoli, cauliflower, cabbage, etc. Cooked again, mm -hmm. fine. Okay, cooked again. You can have them cooked or raw. Now, finally, and I think this is the most important one, is garlic. Yeah. Who likes garlic? It's so true. All right. Now here's the you thing. You don't like garlic? It's so good for no, you. I just got married. I can't I have know. garlic. Well, I actually, it's Mark, true. I got to get around for you. Got you. No, you better yeah. I got to get around. Better do it now. So here's the deal with garlic. It needs to be raw because it's a compound called allicin, right? It's released when you crush raw garlic. So you could put it in your mayo, your salad dressing, whatever. I want you to try and have it in at home every single day. It's now, so if you cannot tolerate raw garlic, some people, Mark, if you don't like it, yeah. you can always go to a supplement. There is one here called Kyolic, which you won't, you know, have that breath or. Or the, yeah, you know the sure. stomach burning or whatever, but very important. Garlic. But truthfully, yeah. if she eats it and you eat it, it's fine. You cancel your. Oh. Right. But it yeah. has to yes. be raw. Uh, it has so, to be raw. And, and Julie is so healthy. I bet you she's probably already yeah. taking garlic oh, supplements without, without meat. Without, without, without meat. meat. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Is there yeah. Real quick, is there foods that I shouldn't take that will help? deplete my immune system. The most important one to avoid is sugar. Sugar dramatically uh, depletes your immune Interesting. function. So Interesting. instead, replace with these and lots of fresh organic fruits and veggies, and you're good to go. I really want a shot oh. of whatever that batch was. OK, you ready? <laughs> <laughs> um, I, All right, let's watch caution, caution, my friend. OK. okay. Very slowly, because I just burned my esophagus. Kim, I think we've been heavy on the tumor. I think Kim we apparently down wants to put her immune system in shock with go that. On, go on, go on. Go, 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 go. No, no. He's too strong. It's OK. Yeah. He likes oh. it! Oh.